CBS North Carolina's Kelly Kennedy joins us now live from the Red Cross District Office in Raleigh. So, Kelly, what is the Red Cross doing right now to prepare for the storm? Justin, Red Cross volunteers hard at work right now ahead of Hurricane Irma, and I'm joined right now by District Supervisor Mary Donnie. Mary, talk to me about what things are like here. It doesn't seem like it's slowing down anytime soon. What are you guys doing to prepare for the storm? We are mobilizing our volunteers and moving our material resources into position so we're ready to be opening shelters and providing feeding if that need occurs with Hurricane Irma on the way. So we still have a few days until this storm could hit us. What, do you, what is your advice to people out there right now to prepare ahead of time? Prepare now. Get water. Take money out of the bank in case there's power outages. Get gas in your cars. Get your go kit. Get ready. If you need to go to a shelter, seek higher ground. If there's a lot of flooding, turn around. Don't drown. Go on to our emergency app. We have lots of information. Your county will have information on how to prepare a kit and take care of yourselves and be safe. And I know you have been setting up, um, getting supplies together across the state and making sure that you have plans to have shelters in place. Talk to me about what you're doing with that. We are working right now to get our people in place is the number one concern and consideration. And then we'll be getting lots of blankets and cots and all kinds of feeding vendors. We have contracts with folks to provide feeding in the shelters. So we're working to make sure they're ready to go and they have backup plans to provide that food. If we need to, we'll have heater meals. So we're getting all that into place ahead of time. All right. Thank you so much, Mary. And again, make sure you have your emergency kit in place and you have a plan if you do need to evacuate. Reporting live in Raleigh, Kelly Kennedy, CBS North Carolina.